All right, gang, we got 177 Flutter Mill in Leander. And this is a brand new uh, part of Orchard Ridge subdivision, which is a great subdivision. They actually have, um, they actually have a farm, like, like a small little farm to uh, garden, community garden. They have a pool, they have a gym, so you don't need a gym membership. It's a great community. Um, they're still working on this street though, so probably the year being here, there'll be construction across the street. But anyways. This is four bedrooms. All the bedrooms are upstairs. Brand new house, never lived in. So as you walk in, you got the wood vinyl planking. And then on the left side, you've got your coat, you've got your bathroom. Sorry, I thought it was a coat closet, it's not. You've got your half bath. And then you've got your main living space. And as you pan across, you've got some nice blinds in here. There is no ceiling fans. Um, but you got the nice quartz countertops, um, gas, this is a gas community, which is kind of nice. Um, and they even paid for the upgrade on the built in, um, appliances there. So it's pretty nice. Um, he says he does own washer dryer fridge that you can rent for $25 a piece per, per month. Um, he also added a sliding glass door, which is very rare. And as you come in, you got the patio and a pretty nice sized backyard no trees yet you are pretty much on top of your neighbors though um, this particular owner actually bought the house for his parents and then his parents decided uh, they weren't going to come live here so um, so that's why you have the upgrades you got this you also got the subway tile backsplash um, and then that'd be your pantry back there which is a nice size pantry in the garage Two car garage. And um, it's an insulated garage door, so it's not quite as hot in, in here as it um, would normally be on most other homes. All right, as we go upstairs, the upstairs is mostly carpeted. As we go up. Now, unlike the some of the other homes, there's there's usually a game room. There is not a game room or anything like that here. There's just a little landing spot. Straight ahead is the master. And as I pan, there's a little linen closet there. As I pan over, you've got uh, the other three bedrooms and the bathroom. So we're gonna head into the master. Now this home does not have ceiling fans. Um, seems like a very reasonable owner. He was here. Um, so maybe you can talk something into getting a ceiling fan put in anyways into the bathroom tile floor pretty nice tile water closet double sinks with the same quartz as downstairs closet it's not as big as the other homes that we've looked at Then you have a big walk-in, or not a big walk-in, but a big uh, linen closet. Then you have a shower, no tub on this one, but as you can tell, you got the tile going vertical, which is a really nice shower. Okay, and as we walk through, we're gonna go back to the staircase and back to the left here of the staircase. And we have our laundry room directly on the left. So nice free laundry and you have another linen closet in the laundry room, which is nice. Um, having the laundry room upstairs means you don't have to go up and down the stairs. And then you've got bedroom number two. Decent size, normal closet. And then across from that, you've got bedroom number three. And these bedrooms are all pretty much the same, guys. Not much to report here. And then bedroom number four, right next to bedroom number three. And they're all very similar in size. This is probably the smallest of them. This is probably 10 by 10. That one's got a little more shape to them. Um, and then you got your other bathroom here where you've got the same tile floor. As the master, you also have the quartz. And then as you pan through, you've got the tile 
this is a full tub. So you have two and a half bathrooms if you count the master. And that concludes 177 Flutter Mill Drive in uh, Liberty Hill, uh, so in Orchard Ridge Subdivision. Hope you like it.